It's the smallest room in the house, but it could be the most dangerous. This is my bathroom. How does it look? It looks beautiful, but right off the bat, I see a ton of dangers. Jeff Devlin is a licensed contractor and the host of the Do It Yourself Network's Sick. I Hate My Bath. Sickening mold and bacteria lurk everywhere. A shower head is an ideal receptor for mold. The solution? Try a little household vinegar. Just like so? Just like so. I mean, it's not like we even have to mix anything. White vinegar is a great disinfectant. You can give your shower head a bath. Just like so. Husbands and wives have fought this battle forever. Toilet seat up or down? Keep the lid down all the time. That solves many problems. Jeff says after you flush, close the lid to prevent potentially dangerous bacteria from spreading in the air. Here's a chilling statistic. 150 children under age five drown in tubs and toilets each year. If you can do stickers, you can put on this. Jeff says childproof toilet locks are inexpensive and easy to install, and it can help prevent a tragedy. We all know that keeping a mat in the tub prevents slips and falls. But there's another hidden danger that could harm children like my little boy, squeezy toys. They're fun to play with, but mold can grow inside them. Where do kids put toys? In their mouths. Right there in their mouth. So now you're basically feeding them mold. Yuck. So Jeff recommends squeezing out the, the toy thoroughly. Better yet, solid bath toys. I personally prefer toys like this. No water gets inside of them. They're easy to clean. Sharing towels is another danger. Yeah. Do you share towels in your house? Yes. But as we towel off, skin rubs off, dries, and is passed around. These things are loaded with all kinds of bacteria and germs. Everyone should have their own. And finally, many women like me keep their makeup in the bathroom. What's your lifespan of your makeup? Uh, I've always heard three to four months. Do you go follow past that? three to four months? I do not follow that rule, especially with like a favorite lipstick. Yeah. I just keep it as long as I can. Last year, 169 women contracted bacterial infections from old makeup. Jeff suggests writing down the date the makeup was opened. It's a great idea. Simple. There you have it, some useful tips to help keep danger out of your bathroom.